it's Yvette and welcome to Vlogmas Day 28, which means that today is Wednesday, December 28th and I am ready to open my stuff, <laughs> show you what I got. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's start with the cotton cuts. There it is. I think that this is, um... oh heck, I can't remember. I, I get so confused about which one did I just open. You, I, then I just did it. I mean, you know, I think I already told you guys I'm having to film all these in advance. So, you know, I just did the darn thing. Um, but anyway, there's day 28. And... Doo -doo -doo -doo. All right, I got that one already. Um, actually, this is a batik. Um, so, this is the batik that we have received today let me see if i have any salvage hold up nope do not so there it is lots of pluses or you could turn it sideways and call it a kiss um, okay, so that's the first one, which means this is my quilting cotton. Okay, number 28 of the quilting cotton. You only fail when you stop trying. And here is, I'll be honest, I'm like very confused because they both look batik-like to me. So anyway, this is the second piece of fabric that I've received from Cotton Cuts, both on day 28. Okay. Okay. Then I have number 28 from Crimson Tate. I think there's a sticker in here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Y'all, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness. What on earth is she wearing? Got one of those big bubble coats on. That is that is adorable. Okay, um, so now we have a hot pink with scattered dots, and we have a speckled in red. Okay, so those are the fabrics that I got in my. Um, advent calendars, whatever you want to call them. And now I'm going to share with you guys what I received in my latest Yarn Yay box. Um, so it's Yarn Yay Holiday is what it says. Uh, let's get it open. Came in a big box this time. So now you open it and it's got this lovely paper inside so pretty oh oh my goodness it is a ribbed beanie yes please <laughs> now what i love about the yarnier is typically you'll get a knitted version and a crochet version um I love that because I, and I know I've said this before, and it's nothing against anything, but I just personally don't have any interest in knitting. I just don't. Um, I love crochet, and so I'm, I'm, I'm so excited about this. I have, um, I've just been wanting to do it. Uh, okay, so I'll come back and I'll talk about, as I pull it out, if hopefully I'll pull it out correctly, but I will tell you that there is a knit pattern right here, and then there is a crochet beanie. 
I have to say that the knitting one always seems to look better. <laughs> but here is the crochet one. And here is, I think that's the, the knitted one, the one on the front that looks better as far as I'm concerned anyway. There's the one that is knitted. And this is it on the front. And I don't, I like how that one looks better, but I'm still not knitting. I mean, I'll just be honest. It's just, it's not going to happen. But um, let me see, what does it say? Okay, so they have, I'm going to make mine a little bigger if I actually make it. This hat is worked flat sideways and then seamed. Oh, okay. You can adjust the finished circumference by working additional or fewer rows of the established body. Repeat before seaming. Okay. Um, it says their special stitches are a yarn over slip stitch and a yarn over slip stitch through the back loop. I personally have been able to find every single thing I need on YouTube. So, sorry, there's like fabric tifferons all over the place. Um, so you should be able, if you don't know what those are, because I don't know what they are, um, I've always been able to find every single thing I need on YouTube. So that's a good hint. If you go into YouTube and in the search, type in yarn over slip stitch crochet, you know, it, somebody has done it. <laughs> There's always so much stuff. Um, so I just wanted to share that. Um, also, let me see if she has, because they might have their own little video tutorial. I'm really not sure if they do that. Um, they're on Facebook, it does say, um, join Vicki on the members Facebook group. Share photos, stitch along, and live tutorials. So, go look there. You might be able to find it. Uh, that's what I'll probably do. Um, okay, so, there is Montoya Merino. As a special treat this month, our usually solid Montoya Merino gets a splash of speckles across a festive red and lovely gray background. The shade Feliz means happy, in Spanish. We hope it puts a smile on your face. So here is the fabric. Y'all know I'm a quilter, right? <laughs> this is the yarn. <laughs> this is not fabric. Um, Y'all know that I, I am always completely honest. This is gorgeous fab um, yarn. Not my favorite though. This would not be my cup of tea. Um, I, if it were like, I, I'm, I'm just not really in love with the red. I would probably prefer if it were just a bit brighter. This kind of looks orange to me a little bit. Um, and I do like this gray, but I think I would probably prefer if it were like cream. But these are all just my preferences. I can tell you right now that I'm touching this yarn and it is gorgeous. It's beautiful. The feel of it is so lovely um so basically it's just the color and that's just i mean for goodness sakes everybody has different preferences um i don't hate it i would totally make it use this to make something for someone else um it's not like so bad that i wouldn't want to use it why do i look like i have black eyes i mean i haven't been crying or nothing <laughs> <laughs> all right so here's the here's the yarn it's really cool let me see what it says here um you would use an eight or nine needle that's the u.s um gauge y'all it's so small i can barely where are my glasses i have some glasses around here somewhere they're here somewhere i had a pair oh here they are I can't see. Don't get old if y'all can avoid it. Ah, see, now I can read it. Um, gauge, 3.5 to 4 STS stitches equals one inch. 
Uh, it's a heavy worsted, Aran weight, 100% superwash merino, 175 yards. I've got hiccups now. Why do I have hiccups? Hey, machine wash in cold water, lay flat to dry, hand dyed in turkey. Okay, there it is. All right. Um, then they say beanie and headband patterns. That's what we got. I didn't see a headband. I don't know. I mean, I guess you could just make it smaller and it would be a headband. You could just make it go around instead of going. I mean, you know. Um, gold maker's sack. We love maker's sacks as small project bags. This month, to add a little sparkle to your stitching experience, we teamed up Della Q, probably with Della Q, to make an exclusive gold version just for you. Um, wow, look at this is cool. Gold LeMay. May. <laughs> I like that. So it's just a little box bottom. Della Q and Yarn Yay project bag in gold lame. And it's got a little hook on it. You can either, you know, carry it around by that or hang it somewhere by that. I mean, I, you know, whatever, float your boat. <laughs> uh, this, this is so cool. Nice. <laughs> Nice, dude. Um, and then we have a hot cocoa pack. Mike and Jen's. As you cuddle up with your knitting or crochet, enjoy a warm cup of cocoa. Mike and Jen's recipe is made from just five simple ingredients and made in the hot cocoa capital of the world. Nice. Just add water, it says. And there it is. Mike and Jen's cocoa mix. I would, you know, I would put this right in my coffee. <laughs> Certainly would. Uh, okay. I, I'm putting that in my coffee tomorrow. Um, and then there's like a couple of little candies. Yay. Um, and then there is a brochure at the bottom. It says, empower your creative spirit. Crochet endless projects without patterns. 150 thousand plus combinations 19 stitch patterns written plus charts in four construction styles hundreds of projects with size dimensions 100 crochet edgings available in paperback and digital ebooks on amazon worldwide and kristenomdahl.com get 50 percent off 15 percent off with these of these powerful resource books with the coupon code blah 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 at kristenomdale.com. Huh. So there's the book. Crochet Power. I think there's like there's a bunch of them, maybe. I'm not really sure how that is. Um they're showing four different books there. Nope, two different books. And so I don't know. I'm KristenOmdahl.com. That's K R I S T I N O M D A H L dot com. I'm gonna try to remember to put that on the bottom here. Um, if you want to just go check it out. Uh yeah, go check it out. Uh so that's it. That's the yarn yay for December. And I am going to put this over with my recycle pile and there you go another day under our belt and I will see you tomorrow for a new video won't you come back Mwah.